say that again. God will protect the harvest from us until we get ourselves together. How you gonna help somebody and you don't know who you are? You don't know whether you want to hold on, give up, stay in the church, a backslide. How you gonna help somebody and you're waiting on the committee to call you to see where you at? You at the mall? You getting your nails done? You at the barbershop? You going everywhere else you want to go but church? I'm not talking about y'all. I mean, and I know because you're all here tonight. But I'm saying this is the state of some people in the church. They, they come periodically. You're wondering where they've been. When you understand your assignment and you make a declaration that I choose to serve, no matter what, as Paul says, amen, there is no stopping to whatever circumstance comes in your life. You said, I'm here because I want to be here. I don't need a committee to call me. I don't need somebody to pump me up. I choose to serve because I love him. I, I want to know God, and I want to know who he is in me. And, and the same fact that, that as you know him personally, this has to be a personal pursuit because when it becomes personal with each of us, you will undoubtedly find yourself yielding to the call of serving him. Let me tell you something. I'm going to tell you why it's important for the church to get it. And why did I say that he would protect the harvest from the church? Because he paid too great a price for it. He hung on that cross, shed his blood, gave his life that men might come to know him, that you might know him tonight. So why would he release a harvest to our church if we're not prepared? If you don't even know the God that you're talking about. It, it amazes me. I said last night the Bible said the church just laughed. I said it amazes me. I we stand in our choirs and we sing, give myself away so you can use me. My life is not my own. To you I belong, I give myself. You know how we do all oh, give myself away. God says, okay, this is what I want you to do. Go do this. Well, I don't understand why I got to go do that. Do that. I don't look like I need to be doing this. Did you hear what you just said? I give myself away so he can use me. And then when he gives you simple instructions, you can't even follow a simple instruction. Hallelujah. And you wonder what makes the difference in somebody else being blessed in you? Because he obeyed. Let me tell you something. God gave me a few years ago, and I've been said across the country, obey, leave the outcomes to God. Stop trying to figure it out when God's telling you something to do. Just obey and leave the outcomes to God.